All right. Hey everyone, your friendly neighborhood writer here, bringing you back another part of Let's Play Catherine. We are in the Stray Sheep Bar. This is the segment right before the seventh night. This is the seventh night, all leading up to this. Four floors of non-stop terror. Well, let's talk to uh, Orlando. <laughs> That's what they call you, Pat. Actually, let's take a drink first. <sighs> Look, Vincent, you're not hiding anything from me, are you? Looks like I was the only one hiding something. Great. So what you gonna do with a girl you're cheating with? She doesn't know you're sleeping around with her, right? I'm a terrible person, aren't I? This is my fault. I'm not gonna run from it. You go, Vincent! I'm gonna break up with her tomorrow. Once I'm clear, I'm gonna... propose to... I'm sure it'll all work out. Yeah, thanks. Oh, seven tonight, all that stuff. Vincent's finally become clear-headed about this. It was a rough nightmare, for sure. Look like you're in really bad shape. Nothing's wrong with you. I don't have nightmares. I sleep like a baby every night. Oh man! If you keep smiling like that. I'm gonna deck you. Is it Toby? You can tell I'm happy. To be honest, me and Erica are. Uh. Anyway, let's let's have a drink. <laughs> if you check the high scores for that game. Why are you boasting? Huh? What? I've got the high score right now. What? Really? Oh well. uh... <laughs> I'll beat you soon. You guys are really into that game, huh? Yeah. Talking about that game again? Yeah. What was that nightmare about? Oh, phone call. I mean, text. Oh. Yep. Clock tower. Look at the image. Freaky baby. Jesus, that baby. Oops. No, go back, go back, go back. All right, uh, let's take another drink. I know this is sudden, but here's some trivia for you, as you seem to have finished your glass. One style of cocktail that requires the most experience and technique to create is the pousse cafe. What? What is this French shit? Normally, cocktails are stirred thoroughly, but this is a cocktail you cannot mix. The bartender creates a beautiful rainbow inside the glass by carefully layering differently colored liqueurs according to their densities. Wow. That sounds cool. But what's the best way to drink this? Mixing it will ruin the effect. And if you don't mix it, it stays separated. Huh. Perhaps the agony of indecision is part of the Pousse Café's appeal. And that was the cocktail. Empty? How many Erica, colors? Erica, need a there? drink. Why would you want to drink a liquor that's order. like. What, seven different? That sounds horrible. Let's go with sake. Sake. Sake, please. I'll take a beer. Beer. Sure thing. There you go. Keep. Keep on. Hey, about those nightmares. Is it true you're all. Oh. <sighs> Whoa, this is really spooky. Except for Toby, of course. Who may be the perpetrator? Let's go talk to you, weird lady. Would you like to? Speak? Yeah, yeah. You can't accept the dishonesty of politicians, can you? You can't accept the rising cost of goods, can you? I hate, I hate politics. Cost of goods? Well, I, I truly do hate politics. This one? Mr. Justin would say the same thing. Did you know that Justin? Mr. Justin once interviewed a ballerina? Did you know she was Miss Anna's best friend? Did you know that it was Mr. Daniel who made Miss Anna stop crying? I see. Mr. Archie died this morning. Oh crap. What? It's two days until the time of freedom. Oh, I guess these ladies are like a you recap me. of the nightmare. <sighs> Let's see. No. Nah. Everything has been settled. Don't be worried about me. No. Uh, explain when it's all over. Nah. Well, duh. It never maxes out, does it? Uh, that's too bad about Archie, but it was emo. <sighs> yeah, 
Hey, where's Daniel? Sorry you had to see me like that yesterday. I mean, is that really what you want? I mean, don't you love him? We're past the age of believing we'll have no problems just because we're in love. You too. But... He's adopted. He's been working hard all his life to repay the parents who raised him. He fought his way through, dealing with pressures all this time. He's a truly pitiable soul. I knew that I wouldn't be able to marry him. And that he was going to become someone else's from How the very sad. beginning. And now that day has come. Uh, cheer up. Uh, don't patronize me. I always thought I was patronized. You got mail. Oh boy. <laughs> Crap, I forgot about that. We'll continue the story of the mysterious series of deaths. Nicholas Clark, age 29, was the latest victim. What a grisly story. <sighs> Archie Wallace, age 28. Archie? <sighs> oh my, Archie? These deaths are hitting close to home these days. Kath Taylor, age 31. That concludes the current known list of victims. If we learn of any new information. Oh boy. I'm tired today. I interviewed another woman today for a different story. She's pregnant, but she's marrying a man who isn't the father of her child. And she's not going to tell him that he isn't. It's the truth. Seriously? Yeah, but I hear it happens all the time. She doesn't actually know who the father is. So among all the possible fathers, she went for the one who was the kindest and the dullest. Dullest. He'll raise the baby, believing it to be his child. I'm sure he'd be happier if he didn't know. I don't think I agree with that. I hear that in any romantic relationship, feelings decline over time. One theory is that love is a drug, like alcohol or cigarettes. Repeated exposure makes you numb to it. Wow. Whereas it's only hot and heavy in the beginning. It's the truth. Oh, yes. I heard the word cheating. After that, how did things go? Like shit. It ain't getting any better. It doesn't matter anymore. I've decided. I'm gonna break up with that girl. I figured it out. I want Catherine by my side. Plan on telling her about the affair one day. Don't know if she'll ever forgive me for it, though. Well, it seems you have come to a conclusion. I hope it leads you to a good ending. Mm, hopefully. You got mail. <sighs> okay, let's see. No. Nah. No. What was the other nah. one? Uh, this one. No. Nah. Yeah, okay. No. Nah. Alright. Catherine, what is it? I'm sorry about this afternoon. I was rambling. And... Hey, are you really okay? Is something wrong? Don't worry about protecting my feelings. Oh, uh, let's see. Yeah. I'm fine, really. Thanks for asking about me. If something's happening, tell me. We're not strangers anymore. I'm carrying our child. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Then I forgive you. Seriously, I'm sorry. Good night. Certainly sounds like you've grown a pair. Alright. I'll be notes. right back. Oh, hey, Johnny. Alright. Johnny looks pretty bad. He always hides his problems from us, huh? But Chief's so cool. When one of his guys messes up, he sticks with him till the end. And that's his problem. He needs to take it easy. Man, if I was a girl, I'd be all over Chief. Tell him that when he comes back. I'm sure he'll appreciate it. No homo. Sake. Whew. Rumors are bullshit. 
Fuck curses. Wow, liquor's really hitting me today. Man. Shit, I'm just so tired. Why do you get so tired? Just because you had a bad dream. You never wake up with sore muscles from stuff you do in dreams, right? Man, I so want to punch you. <laughs> Man, I'm a ton of these. Oh, Rapunzel. Huh. Look, I'll play Rapunzel later, alright? Toby, you can go eat shit. Even if you are the perpetrator. Hey, tell Johnny and Orlando, okay? All this nightmare talk really worries me. <laughs> I don't believe it. Dreams are just weird. But have you seen the news? One of the victims was a regular here. He was a good man. If this stuff keeps happening... Anyway, you don't need to worry. Okay. I think everyone's still here. Song. Okay, no. No. Jeez, is there anything nice on this? Yeah, bathroom. What is coming tonight? Oh boy. <laughs> well, that's odd. <laughs> what did you see? <laughs> I'll see you at the spiral corridor tonight. I'm looking forward to it. What the? Oops. No, actually, I want to check that picture. Might as well check the picture while we're at it, right? Oh, right. Check phone, inbox, this one, image. Okay. Who's holding the camera? Whatever. It doesn't stab me. Suck it. Mm. That man's voice. I've heard it somewhere before. Marriage is two people becoming one. It's the truth. To bear another person's life is very difficult and very frightening. Goodbye. Yeah, goodbye. Are you the type to see nightmares, Mr. Brooks? Yeah. Shh. Remember them. Every night I've had them. Women aren't the only ones to get the marriage blues. Man asks everything from a woman, but when done so, he feels she is a burden. To pilfer the yeah, palm yeah. rings from a certain. It doesn't matter anymore. I figured it out. I want Catherine by my side, so I'm just gonna settle things. I hope it leads to a good conclusion. But still, Steve's voice, and I've heard it somewhere before. I'm gonna head home. Take it easy, Justin. All this nightmare uh, talk. Same thing. <laughs> anyway, you. Okay. Need to make sure I get my last drink here. Mm. I know this is sudden. Do you know the true meaning behind Nama Ipon? No, A tell type me, of Japanese reader. sake? There are conditions a sake brewer must follow to label their sake Nama Ipom. One, it must only be made with rice and malted rice. Two, no water is added after squeezing. Three, no sake from other batches may be mixed into the brew. This means that the drink is pure rice sake. Use this knowledge the next time you buy sake. And that was the trivia for me. Empty? You still want a drink? Yeah, why not? Yeah. Get a whiskey. Whiskey. Sake, please. I'll take a beer. Beer. Sure thing. There you go. Last call's coming up. Uh, looks like eight. She really looks tired today. Kind of worried. That it? 
another whiskey. Oof. Stupid as I am, I just have to give up and move on. Talk to boss. We're leaving now. All right, here we go. Yeah, I'm leaving too. Are you going home already? I just want to organize my thoughts. Okay, well, be careful. Oh, see ya. All right, uh, yeah, okay, we got time. Let's do one floor of the spiral corridor. How long this part is. Yep, we're going straight into it. Seventh day. Are you here? The spiral corridor is our locale tonight. It is a holy passage to the cathedral. Alright. We're in the home stretch, everyone. Here we go. The spiral corridor. Looks like it's the final stretch. That door is the last door. The road to the cathedral starts here. Your mental powers will be truly tested here. Think hard while you yes, challenge sir. these. Now what? I can't wait to see what they're coming up now. All right. Wait a minute. All right. <laughs> Here. Right. Uh, wait a minute. Think hard. Start over. My answer to everything: suicide. All right, let's do this. This way. Now, what am I supposed to do? Get this part. Okay, now I'm just pulling blocks randomly now. Just calm down. Shit, what am I gonna do? Oops, no, that one. Push these. 
Oh, God damn it. Okay, okay. Don't push anything. Just look. That might help. I got it. Whoa. Oh, I did it. I lost my combo. I'm such a genius. You guys enjoyed it i will see you soon on what is soon to be the end of my let's play of catherine later guys <laughs>